is there evidence to support that concern? So that's what needs to be looked at. Um, and then, if those problems are occurring, are these problems caused by customers of licensed premises? So it could be a problem in an area, but it may not be linked to those licensed premises in the area. And the evidence has to link both of those factors. Having identified the evidence, then it's important that the boundaries are identified of where those problems are occurring. And that's very important um, in, in terms of that. And, and I know um, Sergeant Barrigan has provided um, a, a plan setting and that's setting out the boundary for the area that is being suggested. Um, at this particular stage, Mayors and Staff Police do consider that there is good evidence. And Sergeant Barrigan is, Barrigan is here. I can't believe I didn't get that right. <laughs> I've sat, at, I've sat at many committees where people have called Sergeant Barrigan many names, and I, I do apologise. Sergeant Barrigan, <laughs> Barrigan is here. <laughs> 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 Licensing <laughs> Sergeant is here this evening um, to prevent the evidence that they have um, to support the introduction <clears throat> of the cumulative impact policy. Having listened to the presentation this evening from the licensing sergeant, members may consider that there is evidence that supports the introduction <coughs> of a cumulative impact policy. And if that is the case, then we would have to go out to consultation on that proposal. So, um, Chair, the Royal Commission Sergeant Farragut is here to accept the event for you. What we'll do, we'll do a presentation of the police station to give further information. I know about the members here, I'm not particularly good at that. If you can ask questions of Robin now, or maybe you can work the place. I'd like to put a clarification. Of course, it's going to be with licensed premises. Yeah. Page 45, right in front of the door. Because it is a licensed premises, it, it has a late night refreshment license, yes. It's open after 11 p.m. Oh, well, it's not for our phone. Not for our phone,
do it on this computer, or if you imagine on my computer, that this show will fix it, and then I can flick a little roller button and it focuses in on the area. So if you imagine it condensing and focusing in on the area, as I'm rolling the imaginary, imaginary roller button.
dollars of the online this the red no entry signs or the quite no entry signs or the stop signs where you want to go uh, are where premises used to have a premises license and they've either lost their license or premises that used to be open for the sale of alcohol are now closed but the premises license still exists. So good example of that was this one here, the observatory. Because for a long period of time there's a license of premises, there's a club uh, and after a bit came along and then applied to have it open as an off license.